Today I'm pleased to announce a landmark agreement in health care benefits has been reached with the NJA President Marie Bliston. This agreement is a win-win for New Jersey taxpayers and educators. The New Deal would deliver an estimated savings totaling more than $7 billion over the next seven years. In addition to the $650 million in annual savings and property tax, tax savings, it's only fair that this deal provides $400 million in savings for educators and moves educators back to a model where they pay a percentage of salary for their health care. In the first part of this agreement, the savings will be driven largely by the creation of a new plan in the New Jersey School Education Health Plan benefits, the New Jersey Educators Health Plan. In addition to this new plan, the NJA and I have agreed to work on another plan design that we will call the Garden State Health Plan. But the Senate will be moving, moving two major pieces of legislation, Senate Bill 1928, and Senate Bill 993, a piece of legislation focused on education support professionals and has been a major priority of the NGAEA, one bill on subcontractor, the other on due process. It's just a matter of trying to advance the things that are important to the people of the state of New Jersey.